So since my last video where I said that PewDiePie was a racist, my house got hit by a massive hurricane of just Category 1, and it was actually kind of insane. So whilst I was outside of my house, standing in the middle of the storm whilst it was approaching like a, a badass from Hold May Cry, apparently Boogie298 got into some controversy about whether or not he actually has cancer or not. So that's basically what's been going on for the past, I think, two days recently. It happened very recently, and I obviously couldn't really talk about anything that's been happening for the past, like, like four ish days because my power went out so i literally just couldn't go on the internet for very long i couldn't see what was actually going on and i certainly can talk about whatever was going on so now that we're here to talk about what happened with boogie and yeah basically what just sort of happened was i think what happened specifically was he went on to the law cal podcast that he runs with wings of redemption and keemstar because keemstar was the one that started it up and he was confronted by destiny and destiny was basically saying that there were a lot of inconsistencies with his story about whether or not he actually has cancer or not and that's basically what had just been going on the entire time was destiny was trying to confront boogie about whether or not he actually has cancer or not and boogie just refused to, to show any monicum of proof that he actually has cancer he wouldn't show any medical documents just nothing he didn't he refused to show anything to destiny to keemstar to anybody about whether or not he actually has cancer cancer <laughs> <laughs> Lead Boogie lies about cancer than to fight, hand this shit over to you pieces of shit. That's, yeah, that's just, I, I'd rather can do you that. Get, I'd rather can you do get that. Access go ahead, Boogie, print it, Boogie, Go ahead and print. Can you get your patient portal up on your phone and like send it sure. to Tommy? I'm not going to. Sure, he's, he's never doing that. He does not have a cancer not, diagnosis. Not There's zero percent chance he has one. And you won't prove it. His face no. You won't prove no. it. I'd rather if, you go ahead and print it. If print this it. is true, ahead, if this it. is true, and you lied go about ahead, cancer, this is the biggest scandal on the fucking internet. And it's you, not, you, but go ahead and print feelings. anyway. Go ahead and print it anyway. Going yeah. I prove it. Prove it. None of you motherfuckers. Go. Fucking I said this prove two it. Years ago, and I'm not doing it today. This even sparked people to start offering Boogie to actually take money from them. The people were offering money so that way he can actually show any sort of medical document that proves whether or not he does in fact actually have cancer. He just refused to do that the entire fucking time and I don't know why. You would think that if someone was so desperate for cash like Boogie is as he constantly fucking is because he's always asking for money, asking people to give him money and he recently got into some trouble because he was promoting a crypto scams and he took like 10k from the people who made I think fatty coin i think it was so he obviously needs the money and you would think that with him needing to be able to pay off his medical bills for cancer he would take i think destiny offered like ten thousand dollars or something like that and at some point it got upwards to like 80k so that's a lot of cash that he could have taken and used that for his cancer treatment but instead he just shook his head shrugged his shoulders and was like no -uh, nope mm -mm, not gonna show you i'm not gonna do it i'm not gonna show you i'm not gonna show you and just that was the entire live stream and i think at a certain point he just decided to get naked as like a last resort or something like that i have no idea what happened i'm still kind of lost on a lot of the details but the most important thing was the fact that he is just pathologically lying about everything you could ask him what the one piece is from the manga series one piece and he will tell you exactly what it is it's uh like a piece of cornbread or it's the world's most satisfying vibrator that any woman could use or it's the world's most magnificent looking dildo you've ever seen in your entire fucking life i don't know just he'll lie about whatever you ask him and say that he knows exactly what it is when he doesn't know it just it certainly just seems so in character that he would lie about something like this i'll go ahead and say that it's all alleged we don't really know of whether or not he does or doesn't have cancer because we don't have any proof that proves otherwise so there's not really anything to suggest that he doesn't have it but with him being a pathological liar and being no known to lie about a lot of things and even going as far as to promoting a crypto scam to his fans, whatever fans he still currently has left, it does seem pretty likely that he's probably lying about this. Again, it's it's alleged so far because we don't have anything that proves otherwise. I think Keemstar made a post saying that he was going to go get a confirmation test. So if it's confirmed there, maybe we'll actually learn about it. I'm making this video before he's even announced anything in regards to whether or not it's actually real or not. So for all I know, by the time this video comes out, it'll probably come out later today on Saturday, hopefully. Uh, it just, we, we, we don't know, right? We don't, we don't know. Hopefully 
he's not lying about it because so far a lot of people are just going off of the assumption that he is lying about it. It's ruined a lot of his reputation even further than the last couple of stuff that's happened with him. It just He's completely destroyed any credibility that he had. His reputation is completely down to gutter. And that really sucks because he's still a pretty sizable channel and he still gets views on his videos, right? And obviously for a channel of his size, he's not getting a ton of views, but he's still getting enough views to where he's maybe probably making upwards to 7 to 10k a month. So he still has like a, a revenue that he can live off of and use it to pay for his medical bills, but... He just is so extremely lazy that he just refuses to make any sort, any sort of content. And he just says that people don't want to watch him. But clearly, he's still getting a certain sizable amount of views that a lot of people would fucking kill for. I I would certainly love and appreciate if I was being able to make that, that amount of views a month and still make it all that money. But he just doesn't care enough to be able to continue to make, keep making videos to keep financially supporting himself. Because he just doesn't give a shit, right? He just wants to buy, like, whatever, like, cool thing that he wants and waste all of his money away buying useless crap that he doesn't fucking need in order to be able to support himself. So, yeah, that's pretty much the entirety of the Boogie2988 situation. It's pretty sad, and I kind of almost want to feel bad for him. But he just does everything in his conceivable way to be able to make me not feel bad for him. So I don't. I don't feel bad for him. He's getting exactly what he deserves and yeah that's pretty much it for me uh let me know what your thoughts are in the comments down below i'm certainly interested to see what you have to say about this whole boogie situation uh that's pretty much it for me though i'm glad to be back finally with my power and to be able to make videos i'm probably gonna make something in regards to the sniper wolf thing that's been going on or what had happened a couple of days ago right before i lost my power there's also another situation regarding around another content creator who's been experiencing copyright abuse, so I'll probably talk about that, but uh, only time will tell. I guess I'll just have to wait and see. If you liked the video, be sure to leave a like, and if you want to see more, please be sure to subscribe. Please turn on bell notifications so you don't miss another video. I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.